Here we go. You guys ready? Now you see this is perfect back here. We got trash everywhere on the ground. We got a grease pit that they love to feed on. And I'm sure there's generations of rats back here. Well, if you look all under here, all this cement is excavated. And they literally chewed all the stuffing out of this couch here. I mean, look at this mess. And you can see they actually took all that insulation, all the stuffing that was actually in that couch, they're probably dragging it all over this area for other nesting areas. You see all under here? See all the kick out? You see the burrows in the ground? Actually up underneath. Oh, here. I mean, this is generational. These rats have been here for many, many, many years. There's actually a dead body right there. But it, this is all excavated, though. You can see all the holes under here and all the kick out. And that's a, they're active runways. I'm gonna show you something in here. You see all that grease that's in there? This is an active runway going right into this building. It's all called sebum. And that's what happens when, uh, you know, it's a constant runway for rodents to go back and forth from a certain area. We'll get a grease buildup. So obviously this place definitely has an issue. There's probably 10 different pest control company bait stations out in these alleyways. We used to take care of this one particular building several years ago, and um, we were probably catching about a dozen rats in here at a shot. And nothing's changed. They still got the, the baskets of crabs that they used to hold on the outside. And that was the, the rat's primary source of food. All right, where I was getting at, these parking garages, I mean, these parking lots, specifically down here in Center City, I mean, there was these big buildings here years ago. Um, when, before code changed, when they would demo, demo these buildings, they would just push it all right back into the ground and then pave over it with a blacktop. Um, these have become sources of, you know, rat burrowing areas. Um, again, they're really difficult to get to. They're underneath the ground here. And again, they dig all along the foundations of these buildings. You know, and these guys will try to uh, close these holes out. Somebody made an attempt to close this off with cement, but as you can see, the rats literally just pushed it back in. Like, yeah, like business was never closed down. This was a, you know, a failed attempt to close this area off. I guess this was all kick out over here. But if you come back here, you can see around this pipeline, you got rats running, running to this building. There's a big enough hole there to get in there. 